Random numbers on class pads. So we'll start in main and uh, get the keyboard up because um, there are some built-in functions in the catalog of functions. So we'll tap down, head across to the ones beginning with R for random. And straight away here they all are. Uh, so we'll start with rand and have a look at this one. Um, and if we double tap onto that or tap input, it puts the kind of command there. Now when we tap execute, uh, because I'm in standard mode, it's generated the random digits as a fraction. But let's go back and do that again in decimal mode. So um, tap execute, we get a random number. And every time I tap execute, uh, it's random or at least pseudo random numbers are generated here. And we can use those to um, simulate throwing a dice. But there's a kind of slightly better way. If instead we put a couple of parameters after the rand, and that would be between one, say, and six. And then when I tap execute, it's now generated a random number integer between one and six. So every time I tap execute to repeat the command, then we're getting it's so basically it's very similar to simulating throwing a, a regular six sided dice. Um, if we wanted a, quite a few numbers, we could choose the rand list uh, command. I'll tap input. Now this time, if I say I want three random numbers and tap execute, then it's given me one here and a second and a third. So it's given me three random numbers between zero and one. But again, if I modify this and say I'd like some random numbers maybe between uh, one and six again, so from one to six uh, and tap execute this time it's like throwing a dice three times uh, with faces one to six and if i wanted a few more numbers i could change that to 10 and then we get a list of 10 numbers and every time i press execute i get a different random selection of 10 um, numbers we can do some calculations on these numbers using the um, I'll use the uh, action and list tools and statistics and we could calculate the minimum of the list, the maximum, the mean of the numbers or median or mode. Let's try the mode and if I just tap um, answer, so that would be back up around here somewhere, mode of the answer which is this list, then you can see it's picked out that there were more threes in the list than any other um, number. We could also, um, if I take this command down to another line here and close the bracket and use this store command over here, um, then we can store that into one of the lists in statistics. So I'll pop them into list one. So I'll type in list one using the ABC tab, tap execute. And when I now tap off uh, back to the menu and into statistics, there's the numbers ready to um, use the familiar you know calc one variable statistic tools or whatever we want from here or draw a graph and so on